Donald Trump has been ordered to pay $354 million in damages in a New York real estate fraud lawsuit. The ruling also includes additional penalties against two of his sons and bars them from conducting business in the state. The lawsuit brought by New York Attorney General Letitia James accused Trump and his family businesses of overstating his net worth. The judge, Justice Arthur Engeron, found that Trump and his company engaged in a years-long scheme to dupe banks and others with financial statements that inflated his net worth. The ruling is a significant financial blow to Trump and a major victory for the state of New York. Trump is expected to appeal the ruling, and his lawyers have called the verdict a manifest injustice. The civil fraud case could deal a major blow to Trump's real estate empire as he continues to campaign for the White House. The judge's decision also includes a three-year ban on Trump serving as an officer or director of any New York corporation. The lawsuit accused Trump and his company of persistent and repeated fraud, falsifying business records, conspiracy to falsify business records, issuing false financial statements, conspiracy to falsify false financial statements, insurance fraud, and conspiracy to commit insurance fraud. The ruling is one of the largest corporate sanctions in New York history. The judge's decision is a significant development in the ongoing legal troubles faced by Trump, who is under indictment in four criminal cases, including those related to his 2020 election loss and his business dealings. Despite the legal challenges, Trump is continuing his political activities and is expected to appeal the civil fraud ruling.